We've introduced you to the real unreal at Meow Wolf Grapevine, but Stephanie Mendez went back to find more hidden details that will make your visit extra interactive. We are at the real Unreal here at Meow Wolf Grapevine. There is so many interactive portions. We're actually in the arcade room right now, but there's a lot more that you can see and hidden details that you might not see the first time. I'm here to learn a little bit more about them. Meow Wolf Grapevine is truly the place to be. Now listen, if you've been here once, do not hesitate a second, third, or fourth time because there are so many little details here that you might not catch the first time. I'm here with PR manager of Meow Wolf Grapevine, Connor. Hey. How's it going? Good. Okay, there's a lot, like we said. Um, if, if somebody is like, I've been to the other locations, but I don't know what's going to be different about this one, tell me about this experience. Yeah, I think what's beautiful about Meow Wolf is that we are an immersive arts wonderland, and each of our locations has a fully different, unique narrative story. Line. I like to think of us as almost like a choose your own adventure museum, which is really cool. So it gives you a lot of opportunities, whether you're interested in the art or in the narrative story or any of the interactive exhibitions that we have inside. Uh, it really gets you time to really explore and kind of discover art and creativity in your own way. Yeah, and yeah. what Connor means by that is like, there's truly, there's the, we'll talk about the missing person yeah, first sure, of all. When you walk sure. in, that's the first thing that people will see. And you can either choose to go through that and follow that see the R or there's some other interactive. So walk me through the interactive yeah. portion. So when, when you first enter into uh, the Meow Wolf's, uh, the real Unreal, uh, what you'll discover is that you've been transported to Bolingbrook, Illinois, and a family of two different families who live in the house, both the Fuquas and Delaney's, and something inexplicably strange has happened inside the house. These portals have started ripping apart uh, the home, and you can start falling into the portals when you go in. Uh, in the process, though, one of the children in the house, uh, Jared Fuqua, has gone missing. Uh, he's found himself in the real unreal and is exploring just like we are right now in the Neon Kingdom. So uh, you'll see call outs throughout the home of evidence of the family, including the boy. And as you explore the site, you can actually find different evidence of where the boy has gone missing and where he's been exploring too. Yeah, it's really interesting when I, when I mean details in the house, there's like little boxes with like ingredients or like the mom was a spice person or like there's a lot of different things that are going on here. The beans are the thing that I thought was so interesting when I came. There's little beans kind of scattered around everywhere. What does that entail? Yeah, so we call them our brain beans. Uh, they're these cute little patterns that you'll see hidden throughout our location. And on them you'll see a text number that basically has a prompt that you'll shoot a text uh, via cell phone and you'll be able to interact with the space even further by learning more about the areas that you're in and getting hints to the next ones to find. There is a lot of art to already interact with here at the exhibit, but if you want a fun little scavenger hunt, these are the beans that Connor was talking about. So it kind of relates to the exhibit that you're in. Now, if you text the number that you see on the actual bean with the hashtag, you actually get sent these fun little brain beans, as they call them. Now, I did give away one of them for you, but there are so many hidden all around the exhibit, and it makes for a fun little interactive portion. What's going on this month specifically? Yeah, no, we are so excited that you're coming by for October, especially because we were proud to announce our Cosmic Howl, which is our Halloween festive fun of multiple days from October 13th through the 31st. Uh, and we'll be ending with a great culmination on October 31st. First, which will be our big adulty verse. So it's our adults only 21 and up night uh, where we'll be able to dress up and really enjoy Halloween on a weekday and one of the coolest spaces in DFW. Yeah, Connor, I love that you guys are doing this because hello, Meow is like dress up, be part of what's going on here. So of course, Halloween had to be celebrated oh, here. Oh, can't be missed. And I feel like Halloween's one of the most creative holidays. And that's yes. really what Meow is all about is sparking your creativity when you come to visit. So yeah. we're really excited to be here. Yeah, another great thing about Meow is a lot of this is local artists inspired. What's like the percentage of the local um, tie-in that, that is here? For sure, for sure. So when we came into Meow Wolf uh, at, in Grapevine, Texas, we wanted to make sure that we weren't just in the community, but rather part of the community. We have over 40 local Texas artists. And when I say artists, I don't just mean a painter. I mean sculptors. I mean musicians. I mean video game artists even. So you'll see that kind of uh, Texas flair throughout the yeah. space. In addition to that, we have over 150 Meow Wolf artists based from Santa Fe who helped come tie it in a little bit more into the whole Meow Wolf universe as well. Yeah. Uh, Connor, lots of exciting things to look forward to here at Meow Wolf. If people want to get tickets or just see a list of events that are happening, where can they go? Yeah, they can go to meowwolf.com slash grapevine to learn more about our exhibition and get tickets for any kind of events. Perfect. Well, yeah. we will have everything we talked about here today on our website as well at cw33.com. I'm telling you, there really is so much to see there, so definitely take your time and really pay attention to the details if you go. Big thank you to Meow Wolf for sponsoring this segment.